Hey, what's up, friends? This is Aruna. Welcome to my channel for its creation. Today, I will teach you a very special trick to create shadows in the Photoshop. It's really a very hard part to create shadows. Uh, I have a secret behind it: how to create shadows very easily in the Photoshop. So, shadow is a very important part in the Photoshop. If you don't create a re, uh, the perfect shadows, it looks very fake in the Photoshop. So, I will show you some uh, these shadows. So, you can see the entire part is. very good without the shadows this is looking very fake so with the shadow it is looking very nice so how to create these type these shadows in the photoshop so what i will do i will hide all these layers make a new layer so before doing this i will tell you one thing take a new document so firstly you have to understand the direction of the light from which side the light is coming so i can analyze the light is coming from the right side of this model so the direction will be in the opposite direction of the light so make a new empty layer behind this layer behind this model layer choose your brush opacity i want to use 100 and uh, color i want black suppose i have done this right then the secret is use the eraser if you want smooth shadows then you can work with a large brush like this if you want very hard shadows then you have to work with the very small brush now you can see i can erase the unwanted part now you can see this triangle it's very hard so remove this again make a new layer suppose the light is coming from this side and light is coming from this side obviously the direct the direction of the shadows will be on the another side of this light so make a new empty layer use brush i want 100 opacity now follow the shape of this shoe like this now you have to take a very small brush now fill it with black take a new layer Choose your brush. Very hard brush. I want. Apply here. Firstly, follow the shape of this shoe. I will try to create the shape of this shoe. Then, okay. Now the secret is using this eraser. Eraser. Uh, I will take the opacity of this eraser. around 27 you have to use the brush around from the edges not in between if you want very smooth shadows take a large brush and uh, use it only on the edges of this shadow now you can see very easily i am able to achieve this now you can adjust the opacity as per your need i think the 13 i can understand uh, shadow part is very hard to create when we are making any manipulation now you can see i had achieved a very 
realistic result only with the brush as well as eraser now you can see a very very realistic shadow now what you can do next take another layer choose your brush again make a black shadow to the clues the property of the shadow it is very dark nearby its subject so again make a dark shadow nearby this hue choose eraser opacity you can adjust around the 10 now you can see very easily i had achieved this realistic shadow again make a new layer choose your brush now very small brush i want this time okay now this part is empty i want to fill this part again take a new layer okay eraser it's all about combination of brush eraser i want to much control e let's see very very realistic result of this shadow the light is coming from this side and the shadows are making on the opposite side of this light so let's have this again make a new layer choose your brush here and uh, i want opacity 100 of this brush now make shadows now choose your eraser opacity this time i want 20 So it's a combination of uh, eraser, brush, opacity. Now you can see a very, very nice shadow I had created. So use this move tool, adjust wherever you want. If you want very hard shadows, make a small brush, eraser I want to say. Now again make a new layer, choose your brush, I want opacity this time 60. Now you can apply this time, choose eraser, okay. Now let's see, oh, very easy, very easy. Oh, very easily I had create this. Now take a new layer. I want to create the shadow of this hockey. So the light is coming from this side. Uh, okay, choose your brush and make a round shadow around it. like this believe me guys shadows is a very very important part in the manipulation I want to use this brush this time I will use hard brush Firstly, you have to follow the shape of any subject. Okay. Now choose eraser. Large eraser means you have the soft shadows around.
okay capacity down Okay, now you can see before and after. Oh, very easy, very easy. Now I want shadow of this body part here. So what I will do? Take a new layer, choose your brush. Now this time I will take opacity around uh, um, twenty. I will try to. Okay, I want smooth edges. So. Zero. Now choose again eraser. Now I will erase the unwanted part. Control zero, I will adjust it. Now you can see very easily. I had achieved this light. So again, make a new layer. The light will fall here. Choose your brush, a white brush I want. Opacity you can say nine. Okay, now you can see light will fall here choose your eraser again um, blending mode multiply that's fill I want to reduce now you can see a very very realistic result I had achieved with brush and eraser only so guys uh, you have a, if you have any doubt you can send me a mail you can you can give me a call uh, so there are so many tutorials i want to give you with the wise very very exciting tutorials are coming soon uh, video tutorials are coming soon so we are giving classes in the ludhiana uh, so if you want to take the classes you can call me my number is given in the description as well as in the starting part of this video so thank you friends keep watching our creation